Hello and welcome to the Flutter News. I am your host Rajni Bharara and now it's time to give you your weekly dose of Flutter updates. So here are few changes that happened on Flutter GitHub. Number 1, list view scroll animation performance improvements for Android. This PR was committed by Greg Price and merged on 4th March. Number 2, layout builder will now have better suggestions for parameters options. This PR was committed by James Lee and merged on 4th March. Number 3, Undo slash redo in edit text has fixed where it adds a new entry to the history. This PR was committed by Bruno Luro and merged on 4th March. Number 4, add custom context menus in selectable region on web. This PR was committed by Justin McCandles and merged on 1st March. Number 5, editable text selection has UI improvements for selection handles. This PR was committed by Takashi Kasai and merged on 3rd March. Number 6 Visual density for menu will now work properly for negative values. This PR was committed by Quen Cheng and merged on 28th February. Number 7 Now devices option in CMD will have option to filter and check is connected and interface. This PR was committed by Victoria Ashworth and merged on 5th March. Number 8 Now icon button has three UI options to choose from. icon button dot filled icon button dot fill tonal and icon button dot outlined this pr was committed by quen cheng and merged on 5th march number 9 added missing native like shadow in bottom app bar and bottom sheets this pr was committed by eli sardin and merged on 6th march number 10 image assets now will load faster this pr was committed by andrew kolos and merged on 4th march number 11 added iOS build options with new VM services for dev tool this PR was committed by Chan Hang Tai and merged on 6th March well that's it from this week's flutter updates rest you know the drill if you like the video give us a like and if you think we missed out on any do let us know in the comment section below we'll be back next week with more flutter updates until then keep bluffing